Hello everyone. In this tutorial we will explain what we mean by data hashing, and some of its algorithm. So, what is hashing? Hashing is the process of converting a given key into another value. A hash function is used to generate the new value according to a mathematical algorithm. The result of a hash function is known as a hash value or simply, a hash. A good hash function uses a one-way hashing algorithm, or in other words, the hash cannot be converted back into the original key. What is hashing used for? Hash functions are used to prove integrity. A variable length plaintext is hashed into a fixed length value hash or message digest which called in short MD. This means if you hashed a word with 10 letters or hashed word with 2 letters the result's length will be same. Example of using hashing to prove integrity that you can hash file and send it with hash value to other person and when the other person hashed the file he must get the same hash value to be sure that the file was not edited in the way. Hashing algorithm. There are many different types of hash algorithms such as RIPEMD, Tiger, Xhash and more, but the most common type of hashing used for file integrity checks are MD5, SHA2. We will talk about the most common algorithms, which are M5D5 and SHA2. Let's start with MD5 or Message Digest 5. The MD5 Message Digest algorithm is a cryptographically broken but still widely used hash function producing a 128 bit hash value. Although MD5 was initially designed to be used as a cryptographic hash function, it has been found to suffer from extensive vulnerabilities. It can still be used as a checksum to verify data integrity, but only against unintentional corruption. It remains suitable for other non-cryptographic purposes, for example for determining the partition for a particular key in a partition database. MD5 was designed by Ronald Rivest in 1991 to replace an earlier hash function MD4 and was specified in 1992 as RFC 1321. MD5 is 128-bit fixed-length hash. A flaw was found making it possible to produce collisions in a reasonable amount of time but still widely used. SHA2, Secure Hash Algorithm 2, is a set of cryptographic hash functions designed by the United States National Security Agency, NSA, and first published in 2001. They are built using the Merkle, Damgard construction, from a one way compression function itself built using the Davies, Maya structure from a specialized block cipher. SHA2 considered collision resistant. The SHA2 hash function is implemented in some widely used security applications and protocols, including TLS and SSL, PGP, SSH, SMIME, and IPsec. What is salting? Salting is a concept that typically pertains to password hashing. Essentially, it's a unique value that can be added to the end of the password to create a different hash value. This adds a layer of security to the hashing process, specifically against brute force attacks. A brute force attack is where a computer or botnet attempt every possible combination of letters and numbers until the password is found. Anyway, when salting, the additional value is referred to as a salt. The idea is that by adding a salt to the end of a password and then hashing it, you've essentially complicated the password cracking process. The primary function of salts is to defend against dictionary attacks or a pre-compiled rainbow table attack. Hashing vs encryption. Hashing helps to protect and ensure the integrity of the data while encryption is used to secure the confidentiality of data. Hashing is one-way function while encryption is two-way function. Thank you for watching.
If you like this video please press like and subscribe. Goodbye.